Alrighty, it is time to do some arena before getting into Fear of the Darkness. Ah, so, time to fight some more Ultrons. We got Wolf Tech's defense, which is pretty hefty. Uh, I'm going to try, let's see, I want to do Magneto here, Ultron to, let's see, where is my Ultron? I like putting him over here on the right next to Minerva. And then, where's my vision? There he is. Oh, that's what I was going to do. Derp. I got money. I like money. And I like seven star visions. Booyah. All right. Here's a pretty hefty jump. 8k health. Another 900 damage. Nice. A little bit more focus, so he's more likely to remove buffs and stuff. That's pretty sweet. Can't complain about that. Alright, I got two minutes until timer reset. So let's uh, let's fight Mr. Wolf Tech here. So he's got a big beefy Ronin. Uh, six red star Ronin. <laughs> he's actually, he hits pretty damn hard. If he weren't so slow, man, he's, he's, he's still a little slow. But he is, uh, he's pretty tough. And so, you know, with any good arena match, you want to make sure you got a drink. That's step one. I personally prefer Eagle Rare. That is my drink of choice. And get a cat, because, you know, everybody needs a cat, right? See? Right here. Stormy. He's, a, he's my sidekick. The best sidekick, really. All right. We're going to disrupt him turn one we're gonna stay away from punching that juggernaut because we want him to go as slow as possible we'll call in our minions to come and join us we're just gonna keep doing that stuff uh blinds so just don't want to waste turns on hitting juggernaut and making him go faster uh so we'll do our minion speed ups and buffs and all the stuff and it really becomes a buff war um, I've had some success using uh, Doctor Strange and Vision Spot and Minerva Spot in the past, so uh, I'll probably try doing a video like that soon. Um, but, you know, it's just how it goes. Let's see, Ultron does not have defense up. It looks like Magneto doesn't either. Um, okay, well, uh, let's uh, blast Ultron. He is top priority. Ooh, that was a crit 115k. One hit kill on the Ultron, and that removes all his buffs, too. Ooh, that is nasty. And let's blind all his little friends, and yes, all right. Now we got offense of vision to remove all, all the buffs possible. There we go. Perfect. All right. Oh, we didn't get rid of the taunt on uh, Drax, though. That does suck. All right. Well, let's take away their vision, or not vision, Ultron. Derp. <laughs> And uh, yeah, this is this is pretty good. Uh, we'll slow him down. We'll heal up. Uh, I don't think I lost anybody, but uh, that's okay. We are good. He's just gonna resist any buffs I try to steal, and he's got some good ones. Oh, yeah. Let's just try. Maybe we can get rid of some of them. No. Yeah. See, he resists everything, but that's okay. We have lots of health to de deal with all of this. Um, I'm not too worried about it. And plus my, uh, let's see, this is the one that re steals effects. Uh, let's see if we can steal that death proof. Um, but my Ultron still has his revive left, so we should be in good shape. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and ability block this Drax here because I think his ult's coming. And let's see if we can get this Juggernaut to go and get rid of his taunt so I can focus down the, the bigger guys. All right. Uh, unfortunately, we got to get this Drax instead because he has a lot less armor than that Juggernaut so it's all good all right only two minutes left though I will say these fights that I've been doing with Ultron against Ultrons ooh, and he got the kill so he gets all his buffs prolonged so that's nice um, but man like some of these fights are just so long <laughs> all right let's blast this dude let's do it in 1x we got time let's burn him Bzzz. 88,907 damage. And you saw when I critted against Ultron, it was 115k. So uh, that's pretty spicy. I'm, uh, I'm liking this. <laughs> it's so great that I got this this new meta. Uh, this well, Really, it's not even a team. It's just, it's just Ultron plus whatever. Uh, but I got this new meta, and it's basically just one dude. 
and he just calls in all these other dudes and uh they just go to town like it's it's pretty funny but uh it's only gonna last for about a month until everybody gets Jean gray and she turns into phoenix and annihilates everything in her path mm. stormy hmm. i don't know where he went all right i gotta go find my cat real quick but that was pretty easy um I really think Vision pairing with Ultron is amazing because that offense up ult on turn two is so good. And if they don't have like a Star Lord or something to do a second blind, uh, you have an amazing amount of, of leeway there. Because if they have Fury and he shares buffs on his second turn and the Vision comes in right behind him and deletes all of them, like it is just so useful. So I'm really, really liking vision being back in my rotation for arena offense i'm still not sold on the minerva spot i think strange has better utility against these buff heavy teams but mine's not built quite high enough to where i'm comfortable running them constantly and then i also could swap vision and minerva for rocket and groot um, so groot could be useful for buff cleansing if you're fighting a debuff heavy team potentially and uh she could or he could also be really useful to add that death proof and defense up to not only uh ultron but also all the minions and since all the minions constantly get attacked you know that helps but the other thing i like about the minions being there it, with minerva is that she'll heal on minion deaths of your own so that's really useful to or i guess the minion deaths of the enemy too but anyway she gets turn meter on your your teammates deaths and that includes all those little minions so if they have a really strong aoe like a rocket alt or something goes off and they kill all your minions you know she gets 20 percent turn meter for every one of those so that's pretty solid so you got to think about that too it, it, it's just it's a really nice setup, so I, I'm pretty happy with it so far, and uh, you should be too if you can get Ultron. So if not, you need to be working towards him because look at all these. I mean, everybody I'm looking at in arena on offense in the top 20 has you know some set of tier 13 characters. So uh, I think if we, I don't know, let's see. Oh, he wants out. Hang on. <laughs> uh, if we look at and see, let's see time. Eh, so uh let's see find me i was 598 and i know i don't i know i had a friend recently complete it and he was like 820 and that was like two days ago so a few hundred people are completing it every week i would say uh is the current rate and it's going to continue going up as you know more more people get into it and it is really just kind of a war of attrition in a lot of cases um some of these nodes you just have to hit them a whole lot and hope for the best so how it goes but uh you know keep on pushing for ultron though he is absolutely worth it i i invested a ton of resources gold and materials into getting to him and then getting him and then leveling him up and that's all i focused on for like the last month and it's pretty rewarding he is awesome so definitely shoot for that if you can 